What are you looking for with this suit? Well, obviously, we'll be seeking compensation for the families and punitive damages for the willful negligence of these two companies. But is that what this is really all about, money? No. Is that what matters most to any of us? No. It's about this. And this. And this. Yeah, I know, we have no feelings, no compassion, no empathy for our client's suffering. Can I say something? What does that have to do with anything? In fact, the lawyer who shares his client's pain, in my opinion, does his client such a grave disservice, he should have his license to practice law taken away. It clouds his judgment, and that's as beneficial to his client as a doctor who recoils at the sight of blood. All rise. This court is now in session. The Honorable Walter J. Skinner presiding. Is this the only case? This is a lot of lawyers. <laughs> Sit down. Mr. Fasher. Your Honor. You're looking well. The Red Sox must be in first place. Well, Roger Clemens is the answer to my prayers. <laughs> you have some interest in this case? Uh, I'm a co-defendant, so I guess I do have an interest, but it's not my motion. It's Foley Hawaii's. And that motion is? Your Honor, if I might, my name is Jan Schlickman. I know, sit down. <laughs> now, the matter before us seems to be a simple one. Your Honor, I'm sorry, but I don't think it is simple. May I hear it? No, you see, the true intention of this motion is to try to place me under a cloud of impropriety in your courtroom, right from the beginning. Really? Yes. What they're saying with this motion is that they know the law and I don't. What they're saying is that they're real lawyers and I'm not. They're just trying to humiliate me. Mr. Schlickman. You are a personal injury lawyer, are you not? I think you'll survive that. You see, it's starting already. No, you've started already. No, well, I, I'm on the defensive already, and they're the defendants. Mr. Schlichtman, I, I'm do you think I might at least hear this motion before you explain to me what it's really about? Of course. Thank you. <clears throat> now, Mr. Uh, Cheeseman, is it? Cheeseman. Cheeseman, your motion to dismiss is based on? Uh, rule 11, Your Honor, uh, specifically on the fact that uh, Mr. Schlickman had absolutely no evidential grounds on which to bring this suit. Uh, only his knowledge that my client, uh, the W.R. Grace Corporation, has a lot of money. Not true. Uh, he performed no real investigation. He did no research of any consequence, uh, except perhaps to uh, review profit statements. And uh, he has prepared his complaint so inexpertly as uh, to render it moot. All untrue. Do you know what Rule 11 is, Mr. Schlickman? Well, to be honest with you, Your Honor, I, uh, I had to look it up. I'll be honest, too. So did I. Do you know why, Mr. Cheeseman? Because it is so old and ambiguous, few lawyers waste their time with it or mine. It's a non-issue, Mr. Uh, Cheeseman. Your motion is denied. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Anything else? No, Your Honor. Set a trial date. Excuse me, Mr. Thatcher. I'd like to thank you. That was very statesmanlike of you not to join in that ridiculous attack. Oh. You're welcome. Well, what we have to do is show how the toxic...